Hello everybody, how you doing? This is Mr. Douse. On this video, I'm going to talk about a uh, triangle sum theorem again. This is part two. Remember on the first one, the triangle sum theorem is uh, all the angles inside of a triangle are always going to equal 180 degrees. Well, this one is taking a different spin on it. Um, on this problem, this is the only problem I have, and then the video is going to be done. It says find x and the measure of each angle. This problem is different than the ones I did on the on the first video, and that I actually have no clue what any of the angles are. I mean, I have an idea; they're all relative to x, uh, but I don't know what x is here. And so this is as, as hard as I'm going to get for my kind of students on this kind of problem. And so I figured I'd make a video on it. So find x and then also find the measure of each angle. And so um, we, we need to find x first because I can't find the angle measures until I find x. And so I need to, to use the idea that all these angles are always going to equal 180 degrees. And so this is very important. This is the only way I know how to solve this problem. And so I'm going to use this idea here. I'm going to add up all the angles. So 11, uh, sorry, x plus 11 plus uh, 3x minus 9 plus the 10x minus 4 all of these angles equal 180 degrees. Uh, now I'm going to change colors here. Uh, combine like terms x plus 3x plus 10x all of those angles, so x that's 4x, 4x plus 10x is 14x. Now let me here, uh, let me uh, combine all the, the numbers now. 11 minus 9 is, is 2. Uh, 2 minus 4 is a negative 2, and all this equals 180. And so, again, my goal, I simplified it, and now I need to solve for x. I'm going to add 2 to both sides. I get 14x is equal to 100 and, oops, my bad. Uh, 14x is equal to 182. Now, I can divide 14 into 182, and you get x is equal to 13. And so I know what x is right now. That's actually the hardest part. Uh, finding x is hands down the hardest part. And then from here, we can just plug in the value of x into each one of these angles to find each angle measure. So I know 3 times, that's hard to see, let me go with a different color here. Uh, we know that 3 times uh, 13 is 39. 39 minus 9 is 30 degrees. So this angle is 30 degrees. Uh, we have a 13 plus 11, well that's 24 degrees. And then we have a 10 times 13 minus 4. Well, this is 130. 130 minus 4 is 126 degrees. And we're done. And if you want to just double check it, I can add all these angles again together. So I can take 126 plus 30 plus 24. And let's see here. This will give me an extra one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And I get back to 180 degrees. And so again, this is a, a different take on how to find triangle sum theorem problems when dealing with x. And I hope this helps. Have a good day. Bye-bye.